everyone, it's me, I'm back with another video, and this video is going to be about how to care for Addie's hair, and as you can see, it's uh, loose right now, and so I'm going to show you how to care for her hair, just because it's a lot different than most dolls' hair, it's textured and wavy and very, very pretty and long, so yeah, I'm going to show you how you care for her hair. So when you brush out her hair, you can use a brush if you want, but I definitely recommend having a pick. Um, this is just from Man Girl, their sparkly hair pick. Um, because you can still use a brush like this, but this will work much, much better than if you just brush it out normally with a brush. Because this just, ha I don't know exactly why, but for me it just normally works out a lot better. And like with any other doll's hair, you will need a spray bottle full of coolish water in a spray bottle. And yeah, I just have one of these from Target being used any type of spray bottle. So the texture of her hair is very interesting and I really, really like it. But as you can see, the strands are kind of separated a little bit and they're kind of... Why is this not focusing? I'm really sorry guys. Very, very pretty. It just each strand is kind of very wavy. And here's kind of what it looks like spread out, if you can see that. But, um, yeah, it just kind of looks like that. It's very pretty. So, if you want to know just how to brush it and stuff and just make it smooth and get out all the tangles, like I said, um, I'd recommend using a hair pick and a spray bottle full of water. So, yeah, I'm just gonna turn her around. So right here, um, you can see her, oops, she almost fell over, her textured hair pretty well. Um, yeah, that's just really what it looks like. It's very pretty. And so, yeah, if you're just wondering how to brush it, I will show you right now. So you take a strand of her hair. I normally just go up. She's not standing up for some reason. I normally take one about this big. So then you take this strand of hair and make sure all of these little hairs are separated. So it's like that. Nice and smooth. Then you take your spray bottle and you just... And it, it, uh, it won't get in her eyes, probably not, unless you do one right by her face, like a strand of hair. But in the back it won't get in her eyes, unless you try and get it in her eyes. So then you just spray it down and use your put your hand beneath her hair. With, as you're spraying it so you don't get the rest of your hair wet before you need to and so then you take your pick and you just gently run it through her, her hair be sure not to like rake it if that makes sense just kind of gently run it through her hair and if it seems kind of dry just add more water her ends are kind of dryish but yeah it's not a, really a big deal because I don't think that's very fixable but not a very big deal in my eyes, but yeah, as you can see, that one looks pretty brushed out right here. So yeah, I'm just gonna brush out the rest of her hair and I'll get back to you after that. So now that her hair is a bit more combed out, I'm going to show you a couple of my favorite hairstyles to do on her. Um, and the first one is just, it just requires one hair tie and it is commonly known as a French braid. So yeah, I'm just gonna speed that up so you guys can, you don't have to have to have like a 15 minute video. So yeah.
so yeah, that was the first hairstyle. <laughs> I actually didn't mean it to be a side French braid. That was kind of an accident, um, but I it looks cute both ways, I think. But yep, that just the French braid. And it looks pretty much like a normal braid, except for a few differences. But yeah, that's um, her braid. <laughs> and so now I'm going to show you the second hairstyle. So this next hairstyle requires a few hair ties, by the way, just so you guys, just so you guys know. This next hairstyle is a tiny bit more complicated, so I'm just gonna just uh, tell you real quick what it is. So I just do three braids in her hair, and then you braid those braids. So it might look more confusing, but that's basically the simplistics of it. So as you can see, I just braided one piece of her hair, and well, her hair used to be split up into three, so I'm going to redo that real quick. So, um, yeah, then you just do the exact same thing to the other sections of her hair, and I'm just going to cut that part out because I think you guys basically already know what to do since you saw this part. You can see I braided her hair into three different equal um, sizes. Braids, although these are longer than this one because her the hair in the back is shorter than the hair in the front on her. So yeah, now I'm just gonna braid these three together. So yeah, once you've done that, you just remove the hair ties off of all three of the braids. And you just braid it a tiny bit more if you can. I really like the look of it, and it's not really that hard at all. So yeah, and that's how it looks from the front. It's really cute. Um, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a thumbs up. And that didn't really look like a thumbs up, but who cares? <laughs> and also, please subscribe if you'd like to see more, and comment any video suggestions like always. And by the way, if you want a video showing more hairstyles to do on Addie, um, just, you know, comment down below saying if you want me to do one like that. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to leave a like if you did. Goodbye.